What's up guys? This is Coach Chris with 1A Soccer. Today we're going to do a tutorial on how to take defenders on, how to take defenders on. We've done a lot of footwork exercises. Now we're going to actually work on our moves and how to beat players. So Coach Riley's over here. She's going to come and help us demo, all right, because she's still young, fit, and really energetic. Um, so stay with us. Hit that like and subscribe button. If we haven't met you before, welcome to our videos. Uh, our basic format is four cones. They're white and then a green cone, as you can see right here and then a pole, all right? And the, the idea here is to start with fast footwork, dribble down the line, and when you start to see the green cone is to make your move. The key point here is to try and make the move right as the green cone hits. So we're giving the defender about a, um, excuse me, the, uh, excuse me, yeah, the defender about a yard of space. So we don't wanna be right on top of the defender when we make the move, we wanna get them faked out. So Riley's gonna demo one real quick for us. Good, Good. little touch. Boom, and she drives it in there. So the reason I like this format is it gives the kids an option to understand where they are, right? Fast, quick little touches, as you saw Coach Riley do. And then the move comes a yard before the defender so they can't get on you. And then the touch goes out towards the side so you get your timing down, all right? So let's go again. Let's see if we can have another yeah. move. No worries. Yep, I'm gonna roll. And go. Good, so it just rolls off that and hits it. Nice and explosive. So as you notice, quick little touches, then the move, and we're exploding onto the ball and getting it. So we'll try another one here. How about um, lunge move? Okay. And go. Good. And right in the corner with that shot, fantastic. All right, so there you have it. That's how it works. All right, so we'll show you a couple more here. Um, so key points, let's just recapture the key points. Number one, start fast feet. You need four or five cones, and then I just put a colored cone there to decide to show you where to go, like so when you're going to make the move, and then a pole. So quick touches down, make your move, get your touch out of your feet a little bit. Now let's talk about the shot a bit. So let's watch Coach Riley one more time, and then we'll talk about the shot. All right, and fast feet, and go. Now you notice, she oversteps the ball, she gets her head down, she locks up her shoulders, she brings the foot back and she drives through it. Especially if she's trying to hit that near post over there. And that's what we're after. So one more time. Okay, number three shot, here we go. And go. Little scissor. Good. And she pops that right in the corner. So, very good technique there. Straight down at the defender, made the move on time. And then a great little touch to get herself out. And then she stepped really hard with her plant foot, gets her shoulders locked up, got her head down, brought her foot back, and drove the ball in. Now, we're not at a great distance from the goal, but remember, sometimes you're going to be coming into the 18 or you're going to beat that last defender. So this could be this could work in a myriad of ways. All right, fast feet. And go. Yeah, great move. There you go. We're going to give her credit. As long as she hits that pole, that's fine. That was a good one. And one last one. All right, and this can be really tiring. So remember, you can also work on your left foot, all right? Uh, we're not gonna do that today, but you can, you can go down the left side now. And there's a few, um, a few more uh, exercises that you could add to this with another pole, which I'll show you at the end. All right, fast feet, little bonus, and go. Up for 90, boom! All right, there you have it. All right, so I'm gonna grab this pole right here. And what we're going to do is we're going to put a little pole like this. So she's going to make a move there and come inside this time. So she's going to make a move here, come inside, and then a little drag here and shoot. All right? So it's a little bonus for you. This is a little added on. So if your kids get really good and they start really shooting well, you can add the second pole and they can go inside. Right? And remember, you can always work on your left side as well. That's really important. Here we go. Fast feet. And go. Good. Good. Yep, yep, great move, finish. Okay, yeah, she's gonna want one more, I promise you. So, remember, key point two is also don't get frustrated. If you miss, just work on getting your shoulders squared up and your head over the ball, right, and bringing your foot through. Keep working on it because everybody's steps are different, everybody makes moves differently, and what you're trying to do here is get comfortable with your move and your shot, right, and it's all timing. So just be patient with yourself if you mess up. All right, here we go, fast feet. Here you go. Good move. Yes. 
<laughs> Killed it. Killed it. All right, there you have it, guys. That is running at the fenders. Now, obviously, we know these are cones, and we know that's a pole. So the next variation would be to have a player there and to go one-on-one -on -one and see if you can pull the move off. We get that. We do get that here. And we're always working on 1v1s when it's live. So we appreciate you guys. Thanks, Coach Riley. Great stuff right there. Okay, and we will see you soon. Thanks for checking out the video. Hit the like and subscribe button. We'll be back soon. Hey guys, thanks for checking out the video. Um, we appreciate it. 1v1 is really important. If you're a good 1v1 player and you can beat your defender or you can defend against your defender, that's the cornerstone of the game and you're going to win most of your battles. So always remember that um, 1v1 is really important. So running at defenders, making moves, beating players uh, is, is super important, um, but you have to constantly work on the move and the timing. So if you're going to make a move and get a shot off, you got to have that timing down. So we appreciate you checking out that video. Hope, hopefully it was very helpful to you. Leave some comments below. Uh, become part of our community. We love that. And um, obviously we'll, we'll see you here down the line. Um, again, hit that like and subscribe button and join us. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it.